Hello and welcome. I'm Maria Ressa. This is your 6 p.m. wrap. Miss Philippines Pia Wurzbach wins this year's Miss Universe pageant in Las Vegas, USA. Host Steve Harvey announces Miss Columbia Ariadna Gutierrez as the winner, but moments later admits he made a mistake. Wurzbach defeats Miss Columbia and Miss USA in the finals. She's the first Miss Philippines to win the Miss Universe title in 42 years. Wurzbach is only the third Miss Universe winner from the Philippines after Gloria Diaz and Margie Moran. The word war between presidential candidates Mar Rojas and Rudy Duterte continues. Rojas hits Duterte after his friend said he doesn't debate with what he called a liar and a tail-ender. Rojas says, quote, maybe that's what people who back out say. Duterte and Rojas both said they were friends, but this changed late 2015 after they questioned each other's credentials. Vice President Judge Omar Binay will benefit most if Senator Grace Poe is disqualified from the presidential race in 2016. If Poe doesn't run, Binay's ratings would go up 10 points to 33 percent, Rojas up 7 points to 29 percent, Duterte's up 7 points to 29 percent, and Santiago's up 6 points to 9 percent. But if the elections are held this December, Poe will have a narrow lead over the other candidates. Poe would lead with 28% of the votes. Vice President Judge Omar Binay would come in second with 23%. Interior Secretary Mar Rojas third with 22%. Duterte fourth with 19%. And Santiago last with 3%. If Duterte doesn't run, Poe's ratings would increase 10 points to 38%. Binay's would go up 7 points to 30%. Rojas's would improve improved by 1 point to 23 percent, while Sanchagos would increase by 3 points to 6 percent. The latest standard poll, led by pollster Juni Lilo, was taken from December 4 to 12. Beijing orders 2,100 factories to suspend or reduce production. The Chinese government says this is part of its red alert measures to deal with smog. Beijing remains shrouded under toxic haze for three consecutive days. The U.S. Embassy says the latest count of harmful microscopic particles is at 172 micrograms per cubic meter, nearly seven times the World Health Organization's recommended maximum exposure of 25 over a 24-hour period. Former Philippine basketball star Lim Engbeng dies Monday after nearly three years fighting liver cancer. He was 64. Beng holds multiple records, including a single-game scoring record of 55 points while playing for De La Salle University. Beng was eventually inducted into La Salle's Hall of Fame in 1998 and the PBA Hall of Fame in 2013. That's your 6 p.m. wrap. Watch our updates daily at 12 noon and 6 p.m. I'm Maria Ressa. Remember, tomorrow begins today.